to make sure that Kenyans at home and those in diaspora have access to government services easily without having to travel long distances, without having, have, having to queue anywhere. I have undertaken that in the next six months, all government services will be digitized and will be available online. All government services. At the moment, we have only 300 government services available online. But in the next six months, we will have almost 5,000 government services online and available on the digital flat platform so that even when we are, you are anywhere in the world, you can, still, you, you can still access government services and we have already agreed with all the stakeholders we have put in place the necessary mechanism to ensure that that happens in, in six months. That will assist many of you who today are traveling very long distances to look for simple things that are consular services. And I have told Mutua and uh, my, my good uh, sister Rosie here that they must come up with a mechanism where you don't have to travel to come and look for your passport in Washington, D.C. or if you're living in Minnesota, if you're living in North Carolina, if you're living anywhere in any part of the U.S., you should be able to get those services online or they have to, de de uh, they have to design a mechanism where even if biometrics are required, they should be available in your town because that's a possibility. So, um, and I know how that can be done just in case, Mutua, you need ideas on how it will be done. <laughs>